One girl is looking to whoop the competition, serving it up Southwest Florida style. You might remember we met with Caitlin Cavedo back in May when she was playing in a tournament in Naples. Well, now she is headed to the big leagues, playing in the U.S. Open Juniors, representing all of Southwest Florida. Wake News reporter Zach Oliveri joins us in studio. So, Zach, how's she feeling? Amanda, she's ready. Caitlin told me she just needs to focus on what's, what she's been practicing and do the best she can. Competing in junior grand slams like this one is something she's been working toward since she was very young. Caitlin Cavedo's tennis journey started here in Naples when she picked up a racket 12 years ago. Fast forward to this coming weekend when Caitlin takes the court under the bright lights of New York City. She will play in the U.S. Open Juniors, which features only the best of the best. You see them competing, you see them in the gym, you see them like you're eating lunch with them. But for Caitlin, those lights don't blind her focus. I know it is like U.S. Open and it's like it's like amazing. It's like a Grand Slam, but I mean, you just have to like treat it as playing another tournament. This will be Caitlin's second appearance in the U.S. Open Juniors. She believes her familiarity will elevate her play. I think being able to go there and like know that I've like improved and I'm I've been there before I'm comfortable. She's seen that improvement since her appearance in the Fine Mark Women's Pro Championship at Bonita Bay Club in May. After this event, she went on to compete at other junior Grand Slams, such as the French Open and Wimbledon. She soared to number five in the International Tennis Federation Junior Rankings in June. It was really amazing. Like one of my goals this year was to reach top five, which I accomplished that. And I hope um, I can finish the year like that as well. When she takes the court in New York, Caitlin will be honored to represent her city, her country, and her family. Seeing them and spending time with them and having them cheering for me like on the side of the court is the best part for sure. Experiences like this are valuable for Caitlin. It's an opportunity to learn, to prepare herself to compete as a professional. The main draw of the U.S. Open Juniors starts Sunday.